Four o'clock, rock. Five, six, seven o'clock, eight o'clock, rock. Nine, ten, eleven o'clock, twelve o'clock, rock. We're going to rock around ten o'clock tonight. What is that right so Join me home. into rock and roll lifestyle for about eight and a half years now. Um, it's not just going out in, in the evening, um, dressing up. It's all about the, the things you have in your home. Obviously, a lot of it, like the, the old fridges, use a lot more electricity than the things of nowadays. Like the television sets now have a different wavelength, so we can't use the old televisions. Although I have got one just because oh, I like the look of it. Things were a lot more stylish then, or not so hard and square as they are now, a lot more curved shapes. It's a lot easier having like a new washing machine, a fridge freezer. I have got a spin dryer, but it doesn't get used. It's addictive, just going around the junk shops looking for things. It's, it's the way of life. Club, not too far from here. Yeah, well, I first met Ellie in the dance club, the rock and roll dance club. We, we were standing about ten foot away from each other. We met across a crowded room and all that. And he's looked at me and I've looked at him he's gone, do you want to jive? And I said, oh, I didn't know you could jive. He's gone, what? And I said, oh, forget it, come on, we'll have a jive. We had a jive and ever since then we've, we've been together. That's what the rock and roll clubs is all about. They have a slow dance and then they leave together. People say to me, why are you rocking? Why do you like rock and roll? Why do you go to all these venues and all these clubs? And I say it's the simple reason that I just love the music and I love the clothes and I love the style and I, I like the people. <laughs> The music I like is a bit of Ronnie Dawson, and here he is here. This is his first album, Rockin' Bones. It's all of his early stuff, bopping tracks, good wild stuff. And this, which is the new one he's just brought out, Rockin' Isis, recorded live most of it with his band that he's got in England. The rock and roll scene in Britain is, right now, is much bigger than it, than it is in the United States. Um, I've been coming over here probably since 1987, and uh, I was amazed at particularly the weekenders that they have, where you check in for three days and cheer bands and dance and play records and everybody sings and smiles. Really a good place to be. Yeah, people come from all over the place. Hundreds of miles away, Sweden, Germany, Holland, they get together for the weekend. All they want to do is rock and roll. I do reception for Hemsby. The last one had about 3,000 people there, so you can imagine how busy it was. It was very, very tiring. You're just virtually awake for the whole weekend, and um, I love it. I'd do it every weekend if I could. I couldn't part with them secretarial job or working in an office all day long. Uh, it just sort of bore me. Rock and roll's my life. I've got to work with it. I can't handle a nine to five to job, you know. Um, I prefer to be around the scene as much as I possibly can. Um, even if it's only just a function or a club somewhere. I've just got to have it around me all the time. <laughs> I 
I'm from Munich in Germany and there's a rocking scene in Germany but it's not as good as in England, you know, and that's the only reason why I moved to England. And only for the rock and scene. accessories today are still very popular, the earrings, this child bracelet I'm wearing, even the sunglasses. She's your fine looking man, she's something else. Hey, look at them! Across the street. And as far as bathing suits go, myself I'd choose this one. It's the whole glamour of it. You know, it's more glamorous than like 90s, you're just sort of slopping around, have your hair however, and you know, um, with the 50s, you've just got to look something all the time. Your, your hair's got to be done, your makeup's got to be done. Um, it's just a really glamorous thing to be into. I couldn't be a 90s working woman, I'd rather be a 50s housewife working part time with rock and roll. I love the music, I want to be around the people. I'll always be into it. And I, I think I should be into it until my dying day. <laughs> dancing, Jay. Dancing, mate. Gonna do some dancing. Gonna do some dancing, Jay. I'll tell you something, though, Will. If he does do it, I ain't gonna stop him. No, no, no. He's got a good background, though, isn't he? Yeah, he certainly has. It's understandable why a lot of people couldn't do it, though. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're doing some dancing. <laughs> 